for joining us at 10. I'm Cameron Kelly. It has been almost two months since 27 year old Christopher Miller was last seen and we learned efforts within law enforcement have come to a halt. But as NBC 15's Shannon Najawan reports, Miller's family has no plans of stopping their own search for Chris. Christopher's mother and fiance have organized these searches every week in hopes of getting some clarity on where he may have gone. But now they don't have law enforcement's help. And without it, family members say they haven't made much progress. What if it was your family? Put yourself in my shoes. It has been exactly seven weeks since Christopher Miller was last seen. I just think the fact that he's still missing keeps me going, keeps me pushing through. You know, I have to be the voice for him because he can't be the voice for himself. Miller's mother, Tammy James, says her family got an immense amount of community support. It's been amazing, you know, to have the, ar I, I call it an army, to have the army of people behind us. It's amazing. But she says she wishes area police were more involved. The least to say, it hasn't been any progress. I think that's where we're kind of like stuck at. No more searches being done on law enforcement behalf. Mark Thompson is captain of support services for the Rock County Sheriff's offices. He says while the incident took place in Rock County, his department can only do so much. We are a supplemental role. Um, Wisconsin State Patrol actually initiated the pursuit that led to the foot, uh, him fleeing on foot. And because he's a Madison resident, he's actually listed as a missing person through Madison. He says without any new information, they will not continue in their search for Miller. At this point, we don't have any further searches planned unless we have credible evidence to dictate a need for a search in a particular area. Meanwhile, his family continues to hold on to hope. Keep sharing, keep praying, keep spreading awareness. Um, any suggestions, please feel free to continue to inbox me and put it on the group. Yeah, just keep sharing. Miller's family encourages the community to visit their public Facebook group, Find Christopher Miller, where they are receiving tips and will provide any future updates. In the studio, Shana Najawin, NBC 15 News.